Good afternoon, I'm Lydia Patel and welcome to this week's Caribbean news on the national and international scene. The Caribbean and the world have two brand new independent countries. St. Martin and Curaçao became independent states this week, meaning there are no longer dependencies of the Netherlands. The Dutch flag was lowered during the independent celebrations in both countries on Sunday, October 10th. However, the Netherlands will continue to oversee the finances and defense of the two former territories. Reports of arm and ammunition distribution in Haiti have surfaced just one month ahead of next month's election. The United Nations peacekeeping mission in Haiti voiced concerns at reports that arms are being distributed as the impoverished and earthquake-devastated country prepares to hold elections on November 28th. The mission, known by its French acronym MINUSTA, called on anyone with knowledge of such distribution to share it with national and UN police and with international election observers. MINUSTA also called on all candidates in the presidential, legislative and senatorial elections to think of the country's future and programs that will restore hope to the people. Jamaica's murder rate has reached a historic all-time low. For the first time since July 2002, the number of murders committed in a single month fell below 80, with 77 recorded in September, police officials said this week. September 2010, according to the police, was also the fourth consecutive month that the number of crimes committed declined. On the entertainment scene, sexy Bayesian singer Rihanna is already in a Christmas mood. The singer is kicking off the holidays early this year with a reggae-infused Christmas carol. Rihanna contributed a tune titled A Child Is Born to the now That Is What I Call Christmas 4 album now out in stores. Other tracks on the album include Lady Gaga's Christmas Tree, Britney Spears' My Only Wish This Year, and Mariah Carey's All I Want For Christmas Is You. In sports, the Commonwealth Games are over and our Caribbean athletes have done reasonably well. Caribbean athletes participating in the 2010 Commonwealth Games racked up a total of 21 medals. Jamaica led the Caribbean total with 7 medals, including 2 gold, 4 silvers and 1 bronze. The island of the Bahamas and Trinidad and Tobago scored 5 each, while there was 1 each for Guyana, the Cayman Islands, St. Vincent and the Grenadines and St. Lucia. And that was your Caribbean World News in brief, but remember for Carib World News 24-7, log on to caribworldnews.com. I'm Lydia Patel, I'll see you next time.